Hey y'all, we're Parmalee, and you're hanging out with countrymusicrocks.net. All right. All right, we're here at CRS 2014 with Parmalee. How are you guys doing? Good. How's your CRS going so far? Oh, it's good. It's been busy. Um, but yes, it's, we got a packed uh, schedule this afternoon and playing a show tonight, so we're, we're having a good time out here. Very cool. Now, just last week you guys were celebrating your number one single. You had your own number one party. What was that experience like, having your own party for yourselves? Uh, must have had a good time. <laughs> 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 yeah, we had a little after party. That was really crazy, uh, which we put on with, because we wanted to invite everybody down. Mm -hmm. You know, the people that rode and, and uh, you know, just friends of ours we've met in Nashville. And on top of that, we had the um, BMI party, which they had the ceremony and uh, gave us the plaques. So it was just a monumental day, I guess. Um, but we, we definitely had a good time. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, just on December 10th, you guys released your debut album. Tell us what that was like, finally getting the music into your fans' hands. Um, I think we all felt a sense of accomplishment. Or like, phew, thank God, because we've been touring for a year and a half mm -hmm. without any music. And uh, it's just been something that's, that we've just been trying to finish up, finish up. And I think it just kind of closed that chapter. Uh, now we can go out and tour behind that. And, and, uh, and we're starting to write new songs now for the, for the next project, whenever that may be. But, uh, yeah, we're just so happy to finally just have something to give to people. And you guys have a busy year ahead. Um, you're going to be heading out on the road with Jake Owen on the Days of Gold tour. Tell us a little bit what you're looking forward to most about that. Um, well, it's going to be our first big tour, so we get mm -hmm. the chance to be in front of uh, – a lot of people, which we'd never had. Um, you know, just being on a normal tour, we're, we're going to write during the day. And, and uh, you know, Jake's a great, great guy, a good friend of ours. And, and, you know, we're just so appreciative that he gave us the opportunity to come out with him. And, um, it's just going to be fun. We've we got a new production uh, coming, and, and we have, uh, you know, it's just going to be a, a, a new experience for us. But I, I know we'll have a, a, a good time out there. Okay. And this is a question for all of you. You guys have all had a great, great year, great just a lot of stuff going on. If you could think back and relive one moment, what would it be so far in your careers? We'll start with you. Uh, the call we got to say Caroline was number one. <laughs> that was pretty good. Um, hmm. I'd say I'd like to go back to the day we signed the deal. That was a big deal to me. That, we worked really hard at getting getting signed to a, a record deal. I'd say uh, at the number one party when uh, we got our, our number one plaque, finally got a trophy to put on the shelf at the house. So. Yeah. yeah. I'd like to go back to the day that we wrote Carolina and then already know that it was going to go to number one and say, hey, guys, six years later, this song's going to go to number one. <laughs> That's a good yeah. one. That's yeah. a good one. Um, now, country music is consistently evolving. It's growing. What do you guys love most about this genre? That it is evolving and growing and that, you know, Bands like us have a home here, and, and that um, you know there's so many different styles in, in, involved in it now. It's kind of the, I feel like it's the music of America. Mm -hmm. It's just so it's, it's so different. If you listen to any country station, they may have something like us up there. Um, to Tim McGraw, to Carrie Underwood, to you know all these. It's so different across the board, but that's what makes it. You know that's what makes the fans come in, and, and you know we just. We stumbled around for a lot of years. We didn't. We really didn't have an identity. We could, nobody could really fit us anywhere. And we're just thankful that kind of country music has come around to a good, good intersection of where we're at with our music. So. And it's CRS Week, and it's all about country radio. What is one song that comes on the radio that you guys just have to crank? We'll, ask, we'll start with you again. Um, my kind of party, Jason Aldean. I crank that one up. Yeah. Um. Oh, let me think, Josh. I'm, I'm, I'm still digging. I'm still, I'm stuck on stay, Florida Georgia Line right now. Oh, yeah. 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 Got a barbecue stain on my white t-shirt. Oh, she yeah. was killing me with that mini skirt. I always got to yeah. crank that one. How, how country feels, Randy Hauser? Ah. Yeah, that's always a turning up song. Well, thank you guys so much for taking the time to chat with us. I wish you the best of luck with everything you got going, going forward, and we'll, we'll see you hopefully out on the road sometime. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for having us.